Hello everyone and welcome back to the TSG. Today we are back with some goalkeeper career mode. I cannot wait. Um, last episode was actually our worst one yet, but I'm a bit happier because a couple of people have commented saying, oh, the animations with diving and goalkeeping on this game's a bit broken, which I thought was the case, but I didn't want to say anything in case everyone else, you know, was, was doing okay on the game and stuff but I do find sometimes the dive that the keeper makes is not usually the best one he either dives down to his left and then saves it with his legs instead of his hands most of the time um, it is a bit strange but a lot of people are having the same problem we got to deal with it I don't mind it too much it, it does make it really hard though um, it's so much harder than last year so any save I make I'm going to be pretty happy with uh, at the moment Especially when you've got a 72 rated goalkeeper. Obviously, we went from, I think Manuel Southern was a 90 in the end on last FIFA. And we got Gordon on this FIFA. So, we're going to get him to around the same. And we're not actually doing too bad. We're slap bang in the middle of the table pretty much. 22 points, 16 games gone. We're getting through it quite quickly. We're against Rotherham today. They are below us. It's a chance to get three points and hopefully push towards the playoff spots. We're at home as well. Right. Here we go. We're starting with a win. It's been a little while. It's been a couple of games. We need a clean sheet as well. Cowboys. Remember, if you do enjoy the content, make sure you smash the like button. Every like does help me out. Um, so I really appreciate it. Pritchard. Go on. Oh, it's a good start though. It's not a good shot, but it's a good start. A nice little bit of football, uh, and we've got a chance. Go on, turn. Pritchard. Nice. Yeah, surely. Danny Ward with the goal. We're 1-0 up. It's 20 minutes gone. Come on. Oh, we didn't score. Well, I think we scored one goal in three games last episode. So, at least we've got a goal already. We can take another look here. I'm sure the keeper is frustrated. This is a great pass from Grant, I think it is, into Danny Woods. He's never going to miss that. A chance to revisit the Goes goal. under the keeper. Oof, it's not the best shot in the world, but it worked. Lindsay. Lindsay. Not before half time. He's hit on the volley. Yes. Good save, Gordon. That's a good start to the episode. We've got our first save under the belt. Again, I didn't feel like I was in the best position there. Luckily, it was fairly close to us. We got down and pushed it away. Ball comes in. Wins the header. Okay, that did not last long at all. Made the save and then from the corner. Again, it was a bit of a weird animation, but... When you head it like that, down and in right into the corner, even if I was in the best position, I would not have saved that. That's right. Oh, we could have done with someone on the line. If we had someone on the line in the back post, he would have cleared that so easily. Yeah, I was never saving that. Right in the corner. One all going into half time then. Full time then, one all. We started well the first 20 minutes and then after that Rotherham were a better team so a draw probably a good result. I could potentially have a couple of stats going up here and then they do so we're now 73 rated keeper the progress is good we're actually uh, about just over a quarter of the way to 74 already so I'm going to keep training him keep getting them accomplishments and we shall rise with his overall. Right so in 19th position Millwall uh, we're playing them today. It's at home. We really need to get the three points now. We've had some okay games, but if we want to realistically push that top half and try and get a playoff spot, we're going to have to start picking up points because we're now seven, no, eight points behind Bristol City and sixth. Anyway, let's get straight into it. Match day, and it's a cloudy rainy one it looks like unless that's just my camera no it looks yeah it looks foggy i don't know i can't tell if that's rain or what strange conditions it looks like it's an evening game decent feet there gets into toffolo pritchard danny ward toffolo oh it's good football it's really nice go on yes pritchard heads up over the bar that was such a good move. He just heads it down and it just bounces up and over. Or maybe even a bit wide even. 
well, he'd be disappointed about that end product. That was good. Just a shame. A it wasn't a goal. Will he play it in? Woods lays him in. He shoots. We make the save against the post. Wow. It is to be a throw. <sighs> I would have been so annoyed if we conceded that. Promising. That will help. Bakuna, what is he doing? Bro. Not only is goalkeeping on this game hard enough, we've now got our own players putting it past us. This is such a horrible goal to concede. Look, he's not even under that much pressure. He puts his head back on and starts to concentrate on the rest of the game. I'm just waiting in case maybe one of them heads it. And then I see it's going straight to him, so I don't bother really moving. And then all of a sudden, it's gone right in my bottom corner. Oh, Bakuna. You bellend. Half time then, 1 0 down. <sighs> to an own goal. Really needless goal to concede as well. There with you. Oh, that is lovely touch from that player there. Bennett. Good save, that. I didn't want to keep running out after what happened last episode. We got dinked by Patterson, so I just kind of held my ground. And he hit it straight at us. Corner comes in. Wins the header. Straight into our hands. And another accomplishment. Full time then. We do lose 1-0. Due to Bakuna. Putting one in our own net. So we have the GK long throw. And the normal long throw trait. I'm going to put the GK long throw on. Obviously uh, the other one doesn't really apply to me. I'm not going to take throw ins. But it would be good to get the long throw. And the GK flat kick. Uh, accomplishments. Or traits on us. Um, so we've got one of them already. I assume the next one is probably a little way away. Right, second place Watford. It's going to be the hardest game of the episode. Let's get into it. I don't know what it is about our boys from Huddersfield. But we started the season really well. We scored a lot of goals. But recently we've just not been able to score many. I don't know if Danny Ward's having a quiet patch. And Pritchard's not been playing too well. Um, but we've been creating chances. Just not taking them. So... I mean, it'll be a shot result if we can beat Watford today, but if Danny Ward's got his shooting boots on, you never know. Grant, that's a great ball. Cross it. Oh! What? I oh, need to see that back. I'm not quite sure how that happened or what happened there. But let's have a look. We'll hide this quickly. So, Pritchard is in. Oh, he hit the post and it's rolled across the line or just in front of the line. Unlucky Pritchard. See, it's just fine margins at the moment. Yeah, but it's not going to be easy. We picked Huddersfield for a challenge in this first season, so I suppose we're not doing too bad. Half time, nil nil. It's not been bad, to be fair. Watford have obviously had more of the ball, they're a much better side, but we're hanging in there. A point against these would obviously be really good. But as long as we hang in there, we don't concede. There's always that slight chance. If we get an opportunity, we can get the three points. Will Hughes. Shoots! Ooh. Luckily, that didn't take a deflection. It went through a few bodies. That could have gone anywhere. 18. Brown. Nice. 18. Loads of space. Danny Ward, please! Yes, there it is. We're 1-0 up against second in the league, Watford. Oh, it's a strange old season at Huddersfield. It's 70 minutes gone. We just need to hold on for 20 minutes. This was a good one too. He waited for the right time and then slipped him back in and drilled it near post. How many is that for him in the league? Eight in the league. I mean... He's not doing too badly, to be fair to him. He's, he's still got it. 18. Pritchard shoots. Oh, God, if we got a second goal, that definitely kill it off. But now we've got a nervy couple of minutes. Hopefully, we can hang on just keep the ball in their half. 
There it is, it's full time. We just beat Watford, second in the league. That's a way uh, to get back on form, hopefully. That's a great result. And it's a clean sheet, even better for us. There's the goal again, smashes it past the keeper. Right, so we have time for one last training session. Potentially our positioning and reflexes are going up, which they have, plus our accomplishments. We're now a 74 rated goalkeeper. Come on! We're valued at 11 million now. We've gone up seven ratings or seven overall ratings uh, since the start of the season. Um, that win actually put us up to 10th. And we've got Coventry, who are bottom of the league, as our first game next episode. That could be the start of a win streak with Huddersfield. Let's hope so, anyway. And, I mean, we would have even drawn against Millwall as well if Bakuna didn't head it past us. So, it's not been the worst of episodes. Definitely not as bad as last time. If you did enjoy, please smash the like button. I really do appreciate all the support. It obviously helps me out as well. And, if you're new, enjoy the videos. Subscribe to the channel. I've been a TSG. Goodbye.